Alright, on to another project. I was going through my stuff and I came across a project that I start gathering components for but never actually got around to doing. And uh, so, what I want to do, what I wanted to do was create something that I could take my phone, my um, uh, MP3 player, Bluetooth, and make a little speaker with a stand for like put my note um, tablet in, and you know, what Bluetooth it together, and then be able to play music and stuff like that. So, I started accumulating pieces parts. Got some speakers. Got amplifier. Got a transformer. It's actually a step-down transformer. Uh, what is that? Oh, it's another uh, converter from bolt one bolt to another. And then, I also got this. Bluetooth uh, receiver. You can hook it up to a stereo system or whatever. It plugs into USB just for power and then has a line out um, that you then can plug into something else. So what I plan on doing is um, using one of these for the receiver and then feeding the output of this into the amplifiers and powering the speakers. Of course, this is 5 volt amplifier, 3 volt. So, this will take it down to 5. This will take it from, I think, 4.5 to 28 volts to 3 volts. So, 3.1 volts. So, boom. Should be good to go. This one takes an AC. So that one will probably be the one of the last things I do. Because messing around with AC, I'll have to create like some kind of protective thing to keep myself from getting electrocuted. Uh, I think I might be able to create something with a 3D printer. So, uh, let's, uh, the first thing I want to do before I get any further, I'm not going to build everything today. I'm just going to cover, cover this in pieces parts. Um, let's make sure the Bluetooth thing actually works got this but then we need a speaker to make sure that this is output since all of our other stuff isn't working and are we gonna go and do put everything together and find out that the first part doesn't work let's make sure this works uh, it's open and pull out a little doodad I don't need that right now because I'm going to be using this which I'm going, what the heck's that? That goes to my Elpatronics. This is the X AX three hundred. That's right. It, what's weird is, is this will actually play Bluetooth, or what's nice about it is it has a um, line in. So I'll be able to take the output from this line in into here, and we can make sure that. This actually works as set. So there's the uh, USB connector. Powered up, I have a uh, um, USB hub over there. Power, that's actually a power supply. Um, and uh, uh, this is just a USB extension. So I should be able to power it up using that. So let's get things ready. Uh, I'm going to be using my phone which is actually I uh, use as an mp3 player and uh, let's see if we can get this thing to actually uh, see if it works so I know this works should be able to plug that in I suppose I could actually read about this vast instructions here um, the H163 power supply. Turn on. Ooh, that's a secret code plug in. 
zero, 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 zero. All right. <clears throat> This point should be on point and like that. And like that and like that. Oops. Let's flip that over. It's blinking, so let me uh, get my uh, Bluetooth up. Devices. And it's scanning. Can see that. Oh, here's the H one six three. So we'll go ahead and click that one. Says we're connected, so turn that on, line on. So now now from Elkbud Studios. It works. Now from Elkbutt Studios. Why isn't this player? Now from Elkbutt Studios. Now from Elkbutt Studios. Now from Elkbutt Studios. Ah, there we go. I can hit the pause button. Alright. Um, step one. That works. What are you gonna Speakers. How am I going to do that? Because you need an amplifier to test the speakers with. Oh. We've got two left, left and right out. So I should just be able to hook it in here. Five volt right there. in the speaker. Let's find out.
Work. So the next step will be team will get 110. Well, it should come out at 5, so we should be good. See if we got enough. Oh, yeah. That's not even. Starts jumping around when you get the full power. So, okay, so, um, we're getting there. Uh, once I get this all working, then I'll have to design something out to hold the, hold the speakers. Probably print or make, make something to house the, uh, the speaker itself, these little speakers. Um, so I get a little better sound. Uh, test out the still need to test out the uh, AC power to DC um, and make sure we have enough power to power everything and here's the uh, Bluetooth just because we're here feeding this in the music. Of course, this is a, I think this is a mono track. So. Oh. oh well. So, it's working. I don't know if I like that noise coming through the Bluetooth thing, but. Yeah, this looks like there's some noise from something. I don't know. I might have to put a filter or something on there. Something I'll have to research. Yeah, well.